What's going on, guys? It's your boy, John the Liquidator, coming back with breaking news. So it looked like CSU head coach has spoken, and uh, yeah, he took a shot at Coach Prime. Guys, for this one here, we got to go all the way up to Colorado. Let's get it. Let's go. <laughs> a situation that just happened up in Colorado, man, dealing with none other than CSU head coach Jay Noble. He was on a podcast late tonight, and he just took a shot at Coach Prime. Guys, this is crazy. Like I stated, man, we can't go a whole week without somebody saying something ignorant about Coach or maybe this team. This is getting out of hand, man. And all these coaches that do this is making it worse on their players because you ain't doing nothing but giving us bulletin board material and feeding the fire, bro. Because we already know the Colorado Buffaloes was being headed on tremendously going into this season. And every time somebody says something, I'm going to be the first one to tell you. I'm going to put it on black. Last, bro. But with that being said, let me play this clip and come back with some commentary. Let's get it. In the second quarter where they fumbled, they turned the ball over, and that was the difference in the yep. game. We can't do that. You got you to gotta go in there and set your jaw, and you got to keep clear-minded, and you can't flinch. And so, you know, we're excited. Our kids are really – you know, we had to do a bunch of ESPN videos, and it was great. I loved it. And, and uh, But our kids came out of those videos really – with a chip on their shoulder. They're tired of all that stuff. They really are tired of it. And I sat down with the ESPN today, and I don't care if they hear it in Boulder. I told them I took my hat off and I took my glasses off, and I said, when I talk to grown-ups, I take my hat and my glasses off. That's what my mother taught me. <laughs> so, you know, they're not going to like us no matter what we say or do. It doesn't matter, okay? So let's go up there and play. And so as you guys just heard in that clip there, man, he made it his point to let the world know when I talk to grownups, I got to take my head and glasses off. That was a direct shot at Coach Prime. We already know when Coach Prime come in the building, he swagged out. That's who he is. That's his swag. That's how he is, bro. Why is this an issue? Why did you have to go on air and squeeze that in there? Why did you make that a thing to just say, well, my mother taught me that? That was very disrespectful. You could have went on and said, hey, I spoke to ESPN, told them that my guys is ready to go, and that's that. Don't come up here and say that I take my glasses off, my hat off, because that's how my mama raised me. You speaking on another man, dog. But I'm going to leave that up to y'all down in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think about this. Do y'all think he was being rude and disrespectful? Um, until next time, keep them bells on because, you know, I'm going to put it on blast. And like always, man, shake the haters off. I'm out of here. Peace out. We ain't got tomorrow. We got now. We ain't got next. We got now. We ain't coming no more. We ain't coming no more.